Hello everyone, I'm going to have a few predictions for Eurovision 2023 later in the video, but first we have to talk about Noah Kirel, the singer who is going to represent Israel in next year's contest. So after last year's bad result, which was the worst in years for Israel, they have decided to scrap the national selection and go all in by bringing their biggest star to this year's contest. If you don't know who Noah Kiral is, she is basically the Dua Lipa of Israel. At 21 years of age, she has already got multiple MTV Music Awards for Best Israeli Act, it seems it's only a matter of time before she becomes the Noah Kiral of the world. No one's gonna be a world-class legend icon in no time. Then again, no matter how big she is in Israel, making an appearance in Eurovision is a golden opportunity and if she wins or places high in the contest, that will definitely multiply her fame. That is how big Eurovision has become in recent years. Just look at Moneskin and how big they have become after winning it in 2021. So here are some predictions. Will she qualify for the final? She seems a bit too well armed not to. She's already a star in Israel and she's got a strong team behind her. We can safely say Israel is not going out in the semis this year. So can Noah Kiral win the Eurovision? I don't know, you don't know, nobody does. We don't even know the contestants yet. It's impossible to make any accurate predictions as the Eurovision 2023 season hasn't even begun yet. Where will the contest take place? Even though London is my favorite city, having hosted four times already, I don't think it should take place in London. It should be a city that never hosted before and for that reason, Glasgow is a good idea. Finally, not really a prediction, these are my expectations, regardless of the city, it's going to be quite a spectacle. The United Kingdom will probably choose a big name to represent the nation. They are going to show Europe how much they missed hosting the contest. Feel free to share your own expectations or predictions in the comment section. Thanks for watching.